English language is the study of the words we use and the influence that has on the beliefs of society and the impact that then has on the beliefs of ourselves. English language teaches you how to write for a variety of audiences and purposes. English language is the study of the history and the application of English language directly rather than the creative storytelling that you would partake in during GCSEs which you've just come out of. For me English language wasn't just a study of dialect and language change, it was also a study of social change and how these changes influence our everyday lives as well as the words and grammar we use speaking, writing or just in everyday conversation. I chose English language because I really liked it at GCSE and I wanted to expand my knowledge. Choosing language for an A level because it will help with the career I want to do as I want to be a primary school teacher. I chose to take English language because I was always interested in the progression and the change throughout times of how the English language is formed. I chose English language A level because I had the career of speech therapy in mind, which meant that I felt I needed more in depth knowledge about the language um, neurotypical people use in order to identify people with speech difficulties. If I could give any advice to myself just starting the subject, it would be when you're choosing your NEA and your coursework, just really pick something you're already interested in and enjoy because for a while I was just debating whether to use one subject or the other and eventually it just wasted a lot of time in the end. Say to myself, just relax, you'll enjoy it, you'll have fun, it'll all be fine. If I could go back and tell myself something when I was choosing A-level English language as my course, I would tell myself to stay organised, to get my homework done the day that it's set, to always revise, make revision cards on things like the language levels and the theories that we learn. Um, I would also tell myself that it gets more interesting as you go along and although it's hard, you do have a great teacher that is there to help you. How language reveals those that are powerful and powerless, where they're from or what they do, and even to who they are as people. I've enjoyed getting better at writing myself, so like now I feel confident writing articles and I find it a really good way to express my opinion and my view on, on topical issues. The best and the worst Thing about the course in a simultaneous battle is the amount of content on the course itself. You learn so much about the English language when you take the subject and even though there is a lot of content to cover alongside the coursework and the general areas of study that you partake in, it is incredibly interesting, it's engaging if you decide to make it engaging and if you have a real passion and interest in the subject of English language then you will thoroughly enjoy learning about the history and the future of the language that we speak. We were offered a lot of one-to-one -one meetings and there's a lot of peer support within the classroom. I think there's lots of value in studying the English language because it can link with so many other subjects and it's also just good to have this general knowledge of our language and our history. But most of all, learning to write these like long, complex, high mark essays is really useful for many other subjects. Like I was able to apply this kind of biased evaluation into many of my other essays I was writing for other subjects. I think there is value in learning A-level English because it definitely expands your knowledge on things. The value of studying English language is that you realise there's no right or wrong way to speak or use language. What we study is very easy to apply to your everyday lives. You learn how to decode the language of lawyers and politicians, but also the sexism and racism that is still in our media, even though we don't think it is. One thing I will take away from the English Language A-Level course is the tools and the methods we learned throughout the coursework, which will help us with research projects at university. There's so much more underneath the surface that until you studied English language you won't notice but now I do notice certain things and I think that's really useful. The language evolves and 
changes with every generation, every movement, and it's never really fixed. My understanding of the power of English language and how it's used in everyday life. Mm -hmm.